Does anybody remember being a kid and you'd have a bowl of cereal and then you're done with your cereal and the milk is left over and that's like the best part because the milk soaked up all of the sugary sweetness of the cereal. So take that concept and apply it to milk in your lattes. This is not my original idea. This is something that I first saw from Mama Made Coffee on one of her Instagram reels. She took Cinnamon Toast Crunch, soaked it in milk for a few hours and then used that milk to steam and make a latte out of it. I tried it. I actually ended up soaking mine overnight to get more of that cinnamon toast crunch flavor and I have to tell you guys it was so delicious and you can do this for any kind of cereal that you like I really like the flavor of cinnamon toast crunch so that's the drink that I'm gonna make in today's video but I'm gonna do an iced version this time because it is so stinking hot outside and I really need an ice drink so let's make a cinnamon toast crunch latte together first things first I'm gonna make a double shot of espresso I usually use the trade subscription which is a coffee subscription you can get coffee sent to you from roasters all across the United States I actually found out about it through mama made coffee herself but I'm waiting on my next order so I just visited a local cafe and picked up some beans in the meantime and if you do make your own espresso based drinks at home freshly roasted coffee is key it will make literally a world of a difference you could have the best most expensive setup but if you don't have good quality like freshly roasted beans it's not it it is not it fresh beans make a world of a difference so you can either use a trade subscription like I do or visit a local cafe usually a lot of them will roast their own beans or they will like outsource and buy beans from other roasters and just buy them that way and you're supporting small businesses along the way Now to make the actual drink, I'm going to add some ice to this cup. I ordered a latte yesterday when I was out and about from a local cafe and I usually always reuse mine so that's what I'm going to be using. So I have my ice in here and this is the milk with the cereal that's been sitting in here for probably like 24 hours at this point. I'm going to go ahead and drain this, make sure I don't get any cereal and use this milk as my actual milk. So instead of using a syrup, your milk is now flavored with that cinnamon toast crunch flavor so it kind of takes place of a flavored syrup so i thought that was a really cool idea that mama made coffee came out with and then you just top it off with your double shot espresso and that is literally it you can even do like a cold foam the other day i did a cold foam and then added some cinnamon toast cereal pieces on top and it was so delicious but i'm just going to keep it like this pop on the lid and we're going to give it a try so good again it's so reminiscent of like drinking that last bit of milk that's left over from your cereal this is so good shout out to mom made coffee for coming up with this concept i'm definitely going to use it for other cereal flavors give it a try super easy to do you get to try out whatever cereal flavor it is that you want and you don't have to buy a syrup that's my little short video thanks for clicking on it watching it and hanging out cheers